Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, do not turn your homes into graves. He said, indeed, the shaitan flees from the house that Surah Al-Baqarah is read in. Right? He has no place. You choose to read the, the longest surah in the Quran. Shaitan will run away from your house. Shaitan flees from your house. He also said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, uh, particularly mentioning Ayatul Kursi. He also mentioned particularly, he said that whoever recites the last two verses of Surah Al-Baqarah, that that will protect him uh, for the night. So, you know, it starts off with the mention of Allah Subh'anaHu Wa Taala. And then filling your heart with the mention of Allah and the remembrance of Allah. So shaitan has no place in your heart. Filling your thoughts, thinking about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, busying your thoughts with, with how to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and how to better serve Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through knowledge. You know, uh, committing yourself to good deeds. All of these things give shaitan no place in your life. And that's the idea. Don't create room for shaitan. Don't give shaitan room in your life. If you give him that space, he will occupy it. Because